All right, what's up, Paul Squad? Welcome back to my Heartbreaker Recap Marathon. So it's now time for Zephyr, baby. That's right, Zephyr Recap. There's actually this recent one just came out, and this is his Captain America Civil War Recap, and it's called When the Avengers Had a Civil War Over Tony Stark's Parents. So, of course, Captain America Civil War, one of the greatest super movies of all time. One of my top five favorite MCU movies of all time for me. And also, speaking of Captain America, I believe they showed like a first look at Anthony Mackie playing as new Captain America. I'm not so sure if they're going to show a trailer for it this month, but who knows? I think they might do it. Either that or Thunderbolts, because you know, Deadpool Wolverine is coming out in three weeks, and then you know, it's part of the MCU. So, who knows? I might drop a trailer for it. So, I'm interested in seeing this. So, Hot Squad, without further ado, we're going to jump right into Zephyr's recap of Captain America Civil War right now. Let's get straight to it. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. And, and throws him to the floor, and look at how he's beating him in. It's just your mom! <laughs> What's wrong with you? By the way, this recap is about 30 minutes, man. Whew, it's gonna be a long one, but it's gonna be a banger each minute. Alright, I'm tired of this, bro. Hey, yo, we jumping! <laughs> so we start off the movie in Lagos, Nigeria. Cap got Lagos, the races Nigeria. Out of him. I know he's going crazy with the townspeople, just like this. This. <laughs> <laughs> but while my dog's appropriating the culture, we got this group of terrorists raiding a facility. And you know when there's smoke, one of them is bound to pull up. <laughs> Man! Falcon carrying Cap into the battlefield gotta be one of the cleanest pull-ups in these movies. You know they had to pull up elegantly. The Avengers committing their favorite activity of blowing up Africans. Yeah, they spent yeah. the whole last movie booming Kaisen at people and they just like, Guess I'll just blow them up again. I know Nelson Mandela looking down tight as hell, bro. But they came strapped up, fully prepared, been ready. Scarlet Witch giving my mans an extended vert. It's crazy. Niggas need superpowers just to do what LeBron James do on a regular basis. You are my sunshine. But Cap clearing out these rooms bad. That turned my boy into a dancer. Yes. That was clean, though. <laughs> Cap reaches the serum and he realizes that it's gone. But out of nowhere, Black Widow pulls up to stop him in they tracks. And she's actually cooking these folks bad, looking mm -hmm. like she's doing the meanest renegade you done never seen. <laughs> but when she's done clearing them out, Crossbones hits a nigga. Started dragging her by the weave. And Widow tries to electrocute him and he goes, Psych! <laughs> And throws her into the tank. And the ensuing scene had me crying. This Looney <laughs> Tunes type scenario. This man Crossbones really said, Fire in the hole. Yeah. Damn. He really about to. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all we get out of Black Widow for now. But in the meantime, Cap's trying to chase down Crossbones like they playing Overwatch. He gotta secure the payload. But Cap gets to the payload and he got hit with the swindle, the switcheroo. The loose can do. Head and finesse yes. with nobody currently at the payload. He tries to signal his men, but what? What is that? A bomb beats <laughs> that hole right into the stratosphere. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, my boy, that was clean as hell. And he's saving black people. Oh my <laughs> god, he's a changed man. But I can't even celebrate this man. Crossbones moving like a Damn. fan, a freaky ass nigga. I'm gonna kill you. What? <laughs> Gets the breaking caps back. Pause. Got him flying, looking like a straight division symbol. He lands and crossbones is talking smack. He's like, <laughs> Is this nigga serious? Like, look at this shysty ad dork, man. They be giving this to anybody, bro. Like, you got a little. Oh my god, freaking three minutes in the um, recap. It already got me freaking rolling, man. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay, 20 minutes now. Oh boy. Kids at Chick fil A hitting a sip and shice. Like, man, take that shit out! Crossbones is really fighting with crash out tendencies because there is no reality where you should be doing a dual handed punch. Like, he definitely made that up. This man's fighting with no plan or home training. Anything that comes into his head, he's just like, That's a great idea. This. <laughs> I'm with that. And I know he was a first round bus pick when he ate a straight hook and reacted like this. I like that shit. I like that shit. Come on. This nigga is crazy. <laughs> but Cap's still getting impressed and you got crossbones like. Yo, 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 what are you talking about? 
<laughs> Cross Bones decides to take a page out of OJ's book and whips out the knife. And this is where Cap decides to lock in because he hits him with a weave, crack, and elbow just to detach his weapon. And I love what Cap does here. He's like, get your mouse control out of here. He spawns another and Cap's like, miss me with that and puts him down with yeah. one kick. He finally takes off the shysty and we see him face to face. I'd be mad too, it's messed well, up what they be what doing, doing to y'all, cause what is this? Yeah. Nigga look half human, half crank, bro, get Damn. this off my skirt. <laughs> but before he goes out, he's like, Cap, tell Peggy I got next. <laughs> Wanda with the assist stopping this creeper nigga about to blow up and lifts him into the sky. But sadly, she needed more time in the lab, <laughs> she never made this shot before. And he explodes Damn. in front of the building. Five. Everybody's down there in shock. And I know Thanos somewhere clapping his hands. <laughs> actually, even. He's like, well, well, well. They got more food now. And because of this event, the Sokovia Accords get put into place. And if you've seen the previous videos, you know I agree. They were killing innocent people all of Ultron and now want to act surprised that their actions have consequences. I don't agree with some of the examples, though. Like, New York should not be on this list. I don't know what you wanted them niggas to do. Of course people are gonna die. You get Rod Wave to come up on stage. You expect the floor to not cave in. And Winter Soldier wasn't their fault. That was the government. That was y'all niggas. Why are you saying F me for? And to make matters even worse, T'Challa's father got booed, yep. making him look like that one fish Damn. from Spongebob. Everybody thinks it's the Winter Soldier, and they get to chase him Bucky down. Yes. And when T'Challa catches wind, he vows to paint the Wakandan soil in his blood. And that's when we get to this. Quick little side note, we have been going live on both Twitch and YouTube. Follow the Twitch and follow the VOD channel. Back to it. And we get to Bucky, and not gonna lie, the way this whole scene is set up, it feels just like to catch a predator. Yes. Bucky. You trying to link with a 13-year-old? Bro, you told me that I missed out and I should listen to Drake. He <laughs> said, I'm in love with you <laughs> seven time and they tears. And that shit was so hard, I was like, yes, yes sir, <laughs> this nigga spitting. I didn't know. Bro, you're dressed like the nigga from you, bro. This not going to hurt. case. FBI, open up. Brother, why I haven't seen you yet? And the boxing starts. They all going crazy in this apartment room, and I know the niggas downstairs tight than a bit. But this is a really fun <laughs> action scene. I can't even lie, yeah. but I feel bad for these soldiers. Y'all pulled up with more attachments than Kim K, but didn't get told you were fighting against two Minecraft creative niggas. <laughs> it's really insane. Bucky really hit bro with this. <laughs> Y'all said we catching predators. These the Avengers, nigga. <laughs> this whole stairwell section really reminded me of the raid and that boy Bucky moving clean mm. as hell. But Bucky escapes and retrieves his bag outside. But I know y'all see this frame. It look oddly familiar. Uh, no. So just like concrete oh, himself, shoot. you know someone's about to get cooked. Oh, shoot. It's funny enough because that's one of my first Zephyr recaps I ever had to. The Karate Kid recaps the trilogy. That was hilarious. That's a great callback there. Yep. That's and answer. the crowd goes wild. wild. Yep. This is a top three MCU pull up bar none, bro. And the way he does Bucky is equally as vile. All you see this nigga do is a carry, carry, weave, pop into a. Damn. Damn. Oh, yeah! Yeah, that's what I'm trying to see! But my man Black Panther moving like LaMelo Ball. He's like, these niggas can't guard me. Move the camera to him. And look at this nigga! Like, nah, bro. One movie, one video later, this nigga looking like this. I gotta stop throwing the goat label around. Whole time these niggas be deers. While Bucky out there getting pressed by a nigga who smelled like catnip, Army offers a distraction for Bucky to get away. But he looks up to see my boy scaling the building like these. Being this clean should be illegal, nigga. I'm moving like DDG. I don't, you don't know gay shit at all, bro. But this particular nigga right here, bro, that's one sexy ass. <laughs> hey, yo. But yo. cap right behind him, and they get to sprinting. And just like the Infinity War scene, this clip is just as cold. Yeah. I don't know if it's because I did track, but seeing three niggas sprint they at super sprint. speeds awesome. is just the coldest Ooh. thing ever. Yes. These niggas moving like it's Mario Kart. Yes. Bro. 
And while they going at it, they got 12 rolling on them at full speed. They straight up tweaking. And looking at Cap had me crying. The queen is fading. Head at man. He can't keep up with these whippersnappers. And Cap had to cop a plea and steal a V. Had to claim defeat and steal a G. Damn. Nigga out there running without no cleats. Okay. He out there fighting while I got his little bit in the sheets. Oh! <laughs> Run to nigga. I like that. But after that garbage freestyle, we get back to this Mario Kart race. Cap passes Black Panther and he thinks he's in the clear, but... Nope. This generational run that he's doing right now is up there with First Avenger Movie Hulk. Congratulations, Black Panther. We added you to the tier list top three. More ops start pulling up, disturbing their race, and because of this, Bucky steals a bike. And these folk really start zooming, and once he gets close enough, Black Panther tries to take him off the V. He gets choked in midair, but hold on, you got too much dip on your chip. Beat this. That was smooth. That was smooth. Nice Bucky kicks him off and you think it'd be over. But he turns to see the Falcon and he's like, free Uber? Yes. Hits a Uber, Uber everywhere and climbs on this nigga's back. I'm crying. They done turned the Falcon into Spirit Airlines. And with how reckless of a driver he is, you're going to be meeting the Holy Spirit real soon. But this scene right here is so cold. Bucky destroys the tunnel thinking he escaped only for T'Challa to be like, <laughs> Black Panther's about to finish my boy off. But and we about to get the coldest standoff of all time Only for 12 to pull up And Rhodey pulled up really thinking he doing some Trust, you don't want to fight me I'm crying, this nigga's threatening to get beat up Like, oh, oh, scary Shut up, man But they all get locked up We get this really stupid line from the Falcon So you like cats? Dude shows up dressed like a cat, you don't want to know more? Like, I don't even yes. gotta roast this nigga, I'ma let you know Miles say it. Kyson, that's the type of nigga that get compared to a bird. Kind of type of nigga to say the bird is the word. Like the and then Black Panther drops one of the coldest. <laughs> oh man, the Anthony Maggie disrespect is crazy, man. And speaking of him, I actually am watching Twisted Metal on Peacock, the first episode. I'm enjoying it so far, it's good, it's good. Lines in the film. It's both warrior and king. How long do you think you can keep your friends safe from me? And here we get Baron Zemo. And Baron yep. Zemo manipulates Bucky into becoming the Winter Soldier. And when I was younger, I used to think random words that activate the killer part of the brain was so stupid. But now that I'm older, this really makes sense. Imagine this in the context of a fat nigga. McDonald's is closed! <laughs> Bucky breaks out and gets it scrapping with Cap off. Damn. But just like the last movie, man, nothing has changed. The Winter Soldier still him, Cap can't box, and I can still watch the finals off the Falcon's head. And he drops Cap at the bottom of the elevator. And he tries to make his way out. Bucky up there boxing in the cafe, and that's where Tony Stark pulls up. And this little hand thing he do right here, Incredible. It's the yeah. little things, bro. This man is so clean. He is that nigga with an ad lib. <laughs> and then flashbangs that nigga. <laughs> but they out here playing hot potato with the blick. And he goes straight <laughs> trying to shoot, but gets hit with the one, two, blah. His life flashed before his eyes. You think he saw Dream with no mask? <laughs> 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 he removes the barrel and look at him smirking. <laughs> Did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> and after this, he gets jumped by the shorties, but I don't know if they got edited on their side or these niggas just cheating. Because the moment Black Widow pulls up, she hits a two-piece and then... When the hell y'all think a switch? Y'all clearly see the scene before. She's right here. You telling me in 0.3 seconds these two switch positions and Black Widow's nowhere to be found? Yes. I'm crying. These shorties really took Toto's boogie woogie and thought I wouldn't notice. Oh, he's he's still it. It's so out of here, boy. But they get packed up with ease. Hat Peggy's daughter looking like she in a washing machine. <laughs> and Black Widow hits him with the Vidal. She tries to... Bro, these edits are freaking... My... These edits are freaking hilarious, man. Knock him out, but he's taking all the CTE to the head. And she gets slammed on the table. But he ain't laying her down to eat her poom poom. <laughs> he straight chokes her out. And she down there like, Stop! This isn't you! Like, what's up with y'all moving? Corny as hell. You don't know him, little bruh! Corny levels are at an all-time high right now, because I know y'all heard that J. Cole. It's, 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 it's,
But wait, 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 wait. The best character about pull up. Hold on. The goat pulls up and he starts kicking on that yep. nigga like he's Sanji. Like, oh, 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 oh. real nigga tapping. And this man all about that action. Bucky strikes and peep the weave into the battle stance. Fire for that. Oh, that's a real one. He's saucing this man up. No powers or super soldier serum. Just Wakandan Za and Fufu in his system. <laughs> like, oh, Prime Minister. His royal highness. What you in a kumulua? Who is she? Can't go. Oh, Kuroka. Get off that nigga, dick, bro. What are you doing? Bucky puts him down and he tries to leave. Abandon the mission. But sadly, they want to escape. He gets to chef in it, man. Rip Chadwick, bro. I love yeah, the man. little sound effects he be doing when he strikes. Man, that's so hard, bro. That's my goal. If yeah, you man. think this glaze is bad, just wait for the Black Panther video. Y'all ain't seen nothing yet. He tries to cut through Bucky's arm, and I love you, my glorious you African king. Son. But trying to cut this arm off with your bare hands is crazy. <laughs> if you ever seen an African cook, you know their hands are immune to all pain. Uh, but this know. is just insane, bro. You're out of your cotton picking <laughs> mind. They flip <laughs> over down the stairs, and they go hit for hit. And call Bucky the Cavs, because he gets hit with a clean sweep. Kicking him over the railing. T'Challa chases him down immediately but this nigga must have had a rip because once he jumps down he already disappeared and this teleportation is getting kind of concerning it hasn't even been four, four effing seconds. seconds and this nigga already oh. gone <laughs> but somehow by straight plot bucky's already at the helicopter yeah. about to hit the jimmy neutron <laughs> But before that happens, Cap returns and hits one of the coldest scenes in yes. the film. Grab I ain't that. even a you Cap laser, but I saw this scene and I was like, damn. In the heat of battle, he don't miss. No. <laughs> in the heat of controversy, he don't, he don't miss. miss. He crashes the helicopter to the floor. And I love no matter how many times he spams choking these movies, once he gets hit by it himself... <laughs> looks like he's about to cry. <laughs> But while he's getting choked, they both fall into the water and in the battle. But once they escape, Iron Man and Cap's beef were at an all-time high. Cap even dropped a diss. Tony, such a hoe ass up, gonna make some suits, nigga. I was like, damn, they squabbling out there. Tony wasn't standing for all that, so they went to draft their picks, and they met up for the smoke. So, I heard you he was talking crazy on the net. Wasn't you talking crazy on the net? Shit, I guess so. I was. You dropping 200 new suits every day, boy. Slow down dropping all that bullshit. <laughs> Black Panther pulls up, and the African uncle in him was the beating. <laughs> You don't want any of this. Alright, I'm tired of this, bro. Hey, yo, we jumping! <laughs> On the road. Oh my god, the goat! 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. I am beat riding with no shame. You have no idea how good this trailer was. Oh my god. Yes. Look. That got the American Civil War World Premier trailer was absolutely hype. Cap, I'm trying to help. And for Christ's sake, can you stop mewing? Alright, you ready? Bet. And they get to boxing. Yeah. But before we even get there, I know I be hating Hawkeye, but I gotta give him his props. Tony could have got caught lacking by this shot alone. Look how fast he put that helmet on. That would have been easy money. <laughs> they all split off into their own battles, but I want y'all to peep who Cap strikes first. <laughs> I'm the nah. Them racism tendencies like the Green <laughs> Goblin mask, bro. He can't let it go. And you think that's the worst part? Look at how he does Black Panther. Yep. Nah, this nigga is crazy. Cap getting double teamed by the two nefarious night skins a coincidence? <laughs> I think nuts. not. I Stark, what do I do? Do what spiders do, nigga. Crawl, I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, my fault, bet. Spider-Man skedaddles on the glass and breaks into the fight. Bucky goes for a strike, but... Damn, man, you made this out of tinfoil? They doing the Winter Soldier so bad, look at yeah. his face. The thought of him having to fight without being carried by that metal arm got him distraught. Falcon tackles <laughs> Spider-Man and they start brawling in the air. Dog, stop running like a little... Man, if you go backdoor me, at least do it right. <laughs> oh my god, nigga. This is exactly what people be saying when they say Spider-Man is holding back. This is a 14-year-old rookie. He hasn't even had his homecoming game. And he's here out saucing the Winter Soldier. But when I make six videos glazing him, it's my fault? Do you not see the peak? And he's not... 
Oh, by the way, speaking of Zephyr's Fire's recap Spider-Man, I saw all of them except the, the spot one when it crossed Spider-Verse. I have that one coming up very soon, y'all. Done, because Falcon dives on his back and he hits a huge turn and disables his wings and ties them up real quick. If you don't get me out of this right now, I'm going to kill you, little nigga. Oh, calm down, Jamal. Don't fall <laughs> <laughs> Dives in and knocks them both to the floor. Two unks down, man. They told me really told me y'all got hands. We done with the nine. <laughs> and once that scuffle ends, we get probably the weakest fight in this entire battle. That being Ant Man and Black Widow. Better, yeah. You see a nigga like me put me in an ISO against Black Widow. She leaving with my number and a wet pair of pants. Oh God. <laughs> Yeah. Ant-Man goes out sorry as hell And when we get to Hawkeye and Scarlet Witch You think these niggas are running through Chirac Every other <laughs> fight background right. calm as hell But these niggas got it looking like Fallout Like where are you niggas? <laughs> hell? Hey Hawkeye up high Down low Too slow <laughs> Gotcha nigga Iron Man looking up seeing It's raining cause I, just said the I know my dog's POV is yeah. crazy <laughs> and he gets crushed under the debris. Yep. We get back to Malcolm Panther against Captain Jim Crow. And peep how he does, Rhodey. Nah, <laughs> 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 I'm really crying. They doing this nigga like Yamcha, bro. Spin back. And my dog, Black Panther, is getting outweaved like crazy. I'm like, say you swear to God! Say you swear to God! And he gets punted away. I can't even believe what I'm seeing. Ant-Man pulls up and he's like, Hey, yo, Cap, I got the best nigga exterminator. Throw this. <laughs> You had me at nigga. <laughs> you had me at. What the fuck? Damn. Yeah, burn them niggas. Really, nigga? And we got Cap and his gang elegantly running, and look at Cap, bruh. Come on, gang. This Disney <laughs> Channel type scene, man. We're all in this <laughs> together. Man, get off my screen. <laughs> the Vision finally pulls up to aid Iron Man, and we get this clean standoff yep. of both sides, and they get. So boxing. Yeah, yeah get the Oh my god, wait, nigga, let me talk! Wait, now, wait. I really like this movie. Top five MCU movie in my opinion. But there's just a small part of me that gets hurt watching this scene. What's that? And I know I'ma sound like a dork when I say this, but the comics The comics very gorgeous to me! It was like 75 characters on each side, and these niggas were really brawling. So to see like six heroes on each side duking it out in broad daylight, that she little weak. I can't even lie. And I got something else to say right here. If this movie wasn't called Captain America's Civil War, Iron Man's side would dunk on them, no questions asked. <laughs> Look at these sides, bro. This Chris Brown versus Rihanna, nigga. Damn, this a yo. mismatch. <laughs> like, even if you remove Rhodey and Black Widow, my parlay still on Iron Man. Like, hold on, bro, and just peep game, peep game, peep game. DJ, if you don't play my... We gon' get to this fight later, but Iron Man right. almost won a 2v1 against two S-tier fighters. Mm -hmm. I promise you, you give him even an inexperienced Spider-Man, he's winning this fight easily. No questions asked. Black Panther can easily pack up Hawkeye, Falcon, and Ant-Man by himself. <laughs> and even if Ant-Man turns big, you take him down the same way you take down a fat nigga. <laughs> Push him over. <laughs> and that leads Vision and Wanda. And this is where it gets kind of confusing, because this is before Wanda got really OP, but before Vision <laughs> fell off. Yeah. So it can really go <laughs> both off. ways. If you think this is the first round draft pick Vision from Ultron, I'm giving it to him. If you <laughs> think this is the same Wanda ripping Thanos to shreds, I'm giving it to her y'all yeah. can really pick the winner here but even if wanda wins they just gonna jump her so yeah i commend the movie for making this look a little bit fair but nah nigga l plot it's armor it's rigged zero oh, out of ten oh, let me stop yapping to get back to it widow and hawkeye get into an iso and i hear all these weak ass niggas getting on a one-on-one -on -one with her like bro get me in that <laughs> Alright, bro, my fault. This is a sick Negro. Everybody <laughs> out here boxing, and Scarlet Witch really moving like defensive player of the year. And saves Bucky from getting packed by T'Challa. <laughs> and I can't even blame her for this one. Black Panther was straight shish kebab in my nigga. Brody mm. swung Boy, his body, body to the side, to the side. and hit a dual-legged <laughs> kick yeah. to his face. The number two seems to be common in all crash outs. Two knees, two fists, two legs, two <laughs> brain cells. It all evens <laughs> out. Fighting and Cap gets a boxing, and oh, yeah. 
Yeah, I'm trying to see this. Look, this ain't your block, little bro. Look, this ain't your block, little bro. That's you. Webs cap up, reels them in, and got him making up with 15 year old toes, brother. Yes, Ugh. I know Dan Schneider watching this tight oh, as hell. How no. happy would that nigga be to add another kid into oh, Diddy's no. vlog? And sweeps it. Got him hitting the my back post, bro. Get up. <laughs> Spider Man webs him in. He's like, ha ha, nigga with no shield. And Cap flips him over, reels him in, and slams him. Haha, <laughs> nigga with no life. Iron yes. Man's out there getting triple teamed by the Falcon, Ant-Man, and Hawkeye. But they low-key get the best of him, because Ant-Man goes inside him, pause, hey, yeah. and starts yeah, rearranging pause. his guts. Yeah. He moving like me and Violet Myers. Just wait, wait on it. That DM gonna hit twin. And Iron Man in this suit tweaking. He in there like this. Hey, 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 He drives Ant-Man out of him, and he's like, oh, he gonna do me like that? Bet. Yeah. Nigga, is that weapon Yama? Ant-Man <laughs> goes big and it becomes this entire video game boss just to take him <laughs> down. And for some reason, Black Panther and Hawkeye get into a 1v1. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't react, y'all. Let me say that again. Hawkeye for an ISO. Man, that boy getting crossed. Like, why is he here, bro? This gotta be a joke. Like, it's so funny. It's like six years and Hawkeye. But Cap and Bucky make it to the helicarrier only for Widow to stop him. And I find it so funny that they both stop. They really trying to gas her up. She can't even fight her way out of paper bag. She posed no threat. They think she's there to stop him, but whole time, she's just trying to put Black Panther on a stun lock. When you put yourself in Black Panther's shoes, this whole situation should have got a mad tight. For some reason, half the Avengers are defending the person that killed your father, and not even the people that swore to help you are on your side right now. Like, nah, I'd have to air the whole place out after that. But they all take down Ant-Man. We get this really cute scene of Spider-Man, I can't even lie. Vision's trying to get Scarlet Witch back through his Bluetooth speakers. I am sorry. I still don't forgive you. Hold on, playing get X back <laughs> Baby, you know that's my song. <laughs> and Rudy tries to be useful and take oh down God. Cap. He's getting pressed by the Falcon and he tries to ask Vision for help. But as we clearly saw, Vision trying to get nasty. So we really gave him this here nigga damn type assist with Falcon spin dashing out the way getting Rhodey sniped. Yep. Rhodey gets hit and he pummels to the floor leaving him paralyzed. And this right here left Iron Man in shambles. Yep, he After was this off. Cap's whole Tony was pissed off. I mean man. Why it gets locked up. We get this really funny Iron Man scene. You said you never can trust a Stark. Who are you? <laughs> Buddy, you try! Bro, just tell me where they went. I ain't saying nothing, bro. I'm standing ten toes down. We got Popeyes and Benny Hanna's in the back, little bro. <laughs> and that nigga got to chirping. <laughs> and while Tony flies to the low, we get the best suit up of his career. Clean. Iron Man pulls up on Cap and Bucky. These two looking so clean, by the way. Mm. And that's when they get set up by Baron Zemo. And Iron Man sees in 4K <laughs> UHD his parents yep. getting boomed off the map. Yep. And I really don't know how you could be on Cap's side after this. Mm -hmm. Not only did this battle paralyze his friend, you kept a secret like this. That's just insane. This nigga's fake as hell. You knew? If it makes you feel better, Bucky choked my mom too. <laughs> hey, yo, and yo. Iron Man starts going on a revenge tour, straight chasing Bucky down. They climbing up this Mario Bros. tower, and every time Iron Man gets close to Bucky, Cap would block his path. Like, this man Cap really hit an aerial choke. This nigga evolving. But Tony continues to push him away like an unwanted child. And it's yeah. crazy. Cap may be the leader, but he's not even top three, bruh. Thor got you wiped down. Hulk got you wiped down. Tony got you wiped down. Like your label boy, you in the scope right now. <laughs> But while they out there boxing, Black Panther is talking with Baron Zemo. And I really like their combo, but I'm just distracted by the fact that this is the first time Black Panther has seen snow in his entire life. This nigga from Africa, I know he reacted like this. Jesus Christ of God, why am I waking up to Gary? Who's the Gary all over the place? They fall to the bottom and Iron Man climbs out the hole just like he did in Iron Man 1. And Cap is still trying to dampen the blow. He's just like, chill bro, it's just your parents. And he's just a nigga equal rights, equal fights. Damn. And they start going hit for hit, back to back. 
They moving crazy right now And Cap hits him with the signature choke And at this point you gotta wonder if you should give him his props Or wonder why he's not on the short bus all-star team Because why are you still doing this? He moving like a methazine Really dropped the same song 27 times And thought something would change Nigga you're stupid Iron Man uses his blast to get him flipped over Got his sorry ass laid out And Bucky watching this front row 4k Like it's playing on the Falcon's forehead And he realizes Cap's just like him A left hand bandit A fraud He can't box unless he got his shield or another nigga so bucky said f all that and got to jumping and we all know this scene tony getting yep. jumped just because he had maternal love for his parents <laughs> like saying this in a real life context is just so crazy imagine getting jumped and the oh niggas God. are just like it's just your yeah. mama bitch nigga <laughs> what but y'all all know this iconic jump this should be in the jumping hall of fame but do y'all really know this fight though let's break it down right here <laughs> all right dj play here we go now the reason why i think this is the greatest jumping of all time you will never see someone get jumped into a touch of death an hmm. infinite loop so bucky hits a pass me the rock yeah. Right to cap, weaves a right and clocks him. Got him looking up to his mother, thou art in heaven. He lets him off with a Sparta kick. And cap hits a spin move right on his chin. And right here is where the loop begins. Peep how they stagger their attacks. The moment Bucky throws this left, Cap is already mid his attack. Having your attacks in a pattern like this will put you in a loop. We gonna call this play the delayed dance because them staggering their hits like this makes it nigh impossible to fight out of. You try to defend, stupid, gets knee like a nigga in a middle school hallway. Try to fight back, <laughs> you fool. <laughs> right in the face peep the crazy baseball wind up to you know that punish hurt this coordinated jumping isn't something you can blindly get out of and this is why i respect iron man as a fighter you need elite court vision to get out the way he did bucky should have struck him right here but instead he passed the rock to cap and when iron man caught this he Beamed him on sight. Despite that misplay, this is still one of the greatest jumpings I have ever yeah, seen. It is. Seeing it in motion is just so beautiful. Oh, the passes with the shield, they moving like this. I pass a rock to Yankee Pong, faked it, pass it back. <laughs> this is straight up S tier jumping, man. Stand it. Bro, the Russo Bros was absolutely cooking the action scenes when they went MCU, man. I mean, Jesus. Innovation. After this, Bucky and Iron Man really run the clean ones. But Bucky wins the ISO, got him on the wall, about to rip out his core reactor. And Iron Man really on the wall, like. <laughs> 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 Uses his reactor and blasts his arm off. And Bucky cannot believe his eyes right now. He is looking distraught. I know he thinks he's one of them pranks where they destroy your phone and then give you a brand new one. Nah, nigga, you're cooked. And this is where we get this clean yeah, shot right here. Like, shot. She like this is what I love to see, bro. Cap got Iron Man on the wall and he is straight beating him in. Like, damn. First Batman, now this. The way they beating down the opponents, you think they the victims. No, they're not. You're just weird. Uh, Iron Man blocks the shield and hits it away. And look at Cap. The only thing that can help him box is gone. And Iron Man's doing them bad. Peep the swoop into the Joe Budden. Nigga. What? He starts beating Cap to a pump and throws him to the floor. Damn. And this is what I was talking about earlier. 2v1 and he's still on top. And he really would have won if Bucky ain't tried to tickle this nigga's feet. <laughs> oh. This nigga the diddler. Cap grabs Iron Man the and diddler. throws him to the floor and look at how he's beating him in. It's just your mouth, bro. What's wrong with you? And Cap really hit a pose like this? Nah, if I was Tony, nah. I'm suing this prehistoric hobo for all he's worth because it's got to be labeled as abuse, assault, and battery, nigga, something. <laughs> but Cap beats him in and in the fight, and Iron Man's like, you can't rip our set no more, nigga. Drop the shield. And Cap <laughs> does exactly that, and in the movie. Yeah. This video took so damn long. Thank y'all for watching. It's like 4 a.m. while I'm recording this oh, one. Wow. I'm going to go get some sleep, nigga. All right, go and get this lease that fight. I know this this came out weeks ago, but yeah, this is definitely one of the longest recasts he ever did. I freaking loved it, man. I freaking loved it. Damn, definitely one of the best recasts he's ever did. W recap is that fire. Keep up the great work, man. Keep up the great freaking work. I love these, man. Honestly, this has one of being one of my longest videos I ever recorded. <laughs> definitely one of the longest videos I, I've um, reacted in a while. So yeah, I really enjoyed this. Definitely enjoyed um Jordan's recap, man. Definitely enjoyed it. So Hot Squad. That is my conclusion of my reaction to Zephyr's recap. Captain Mega Civil War.
Jordan. So, Jordan, please hit my account, share your thoughts. What's your favorite MCU movie? How many times have you seen Captain America's Civil War? And would you want to see it again? Obviously, whenever, sometime. So, yes. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. So, Hot Squad, please stay tuned because I have my last recap for the week. And it is Casper. That's right. I'm finally back with more Casper. So, yeah, I'm ready for that. So, his recap of Transformers A Distinction is coming in a few moments. So, please stay tuned for that.